here we have a 2002 Audi A4, and if you're looking uh, to test the coil packs, which a lot of times these uh, these cars will have the coil packs go bad, it's a very common issue. Uh, one easy way to see which cylinder exactly uh, needs the coil pack change is actually by disconnecting the fuel injector. It's probably the easiest way to do it. Uh, when the car is running, uh, you're going to, basically one of these coil packs is going to be having an issue. Um, and a lot of times you don't really know which one unless you have a scanner and uh, you can find out which cylinder it's misfiring on. Uh, if you don't have a scanner though, uh, there is another way that you can find out which one of these coil packs needs to be replaced. Because they never usually have all four go bad at the same time. Typically it's just one. Uh, and it will still run, it'll just run a little bit rough. Uh, what you're going to need to do is actually disconnect a fuel injector. So there's four fuel injectors here. And the easiest way to do that is just to pull this little pin, push this pin in, and then just disconnect the fuel injector. And you can see which cylinder, by the shaking of the motor, and also by... the misfiring cylinder. And uh, if uh, you can see how... Uh, it has a very specific pulse to it. And uh, basically what that is meaning is that this cylinder uh, has a misfire. Because when you plug that back in, that misfire goes away. And the, the exhaust runs without any bumbles or anything. Um, so that's, uh, that's the best way to figure out how to, uh, to check your coil packs. It's basically finding out which one of these injectors. Uh, I'll give one more example. Uh, I'll disconnect the second one and you can see it. You can see it bumbling. You can actually hear it. And you can see the, the belts are having a harder time staying stationary. But as soon as I plug that back in, it goes away. So it's the best way to find out what cylinder is actually having an issue. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to post below. Otherwise, hopefully this video helps uh, solve your problem with your coil packs and uh, get you back on the road. So have a great day, good luck with your project, and thanks for watching.